Hi guys, what's up? It's Lindsay, and today I am sharing with you a ton of different ways to style black, chunky shoes. My favorite thing in the world when it comes to shoes. I love good platform, I love a good chunky sneaker, a lace-up boot, really anything with some thick platform has my heart. And because of that, I wear them a lot and I get a lot of questions on like how to style different shoes that I have. So I thought I would make this video on how to style five different chunky shoes or just like the way that I tend to style these types of shoes. And hopefully this can help you out. I'm going to be showing you five different outfits ranging from casual to more dressed up and wearing various chunky shoes from sneakers to platforms to Oxfords, boots, really everything. Uh, and I hope you guys like it. Also, a huge thank you to Koi Footwear for sponsoring this video and supplying me with all of the shoes today. They are all 100% vegan and PETA approved and affordable, so I just thought they were a great brand to share with you guys for you to get to know because if you're interested in buying more vegan shoes, vegan leather, it's a really great place to go because it's affordable and I really love the shoes that I picked out. So you will see how I style them once we get into the styling, but I just had to get that out of the way. So thank you so much and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Outfit number one, I'm wearing a pair of super chunky blacked out sneakers. I love the look of these. I would most likely pair them with a casual outfit since they are quite casual shoes. They're just a pair of sneakers. So I am wearing them with a vintage t-shirt and some vintage plaid trousers. I love these pants. They go with everything even though they're plaid. Like they're a neutral even though it's a pattern. So I love that and the shirt is just super fun. I really love the look of a vintage graphic tee with some trousers because it just kind of dresses them down and it looks really casual and also put together at the same time. And then I love adding Adding this thick sporty chunky shoe it just edges up the outfit a little bit and it also goes with my bag which is my everyday bag I wear it in almost every video it is from rag and bone outfit number two I am styling a pair of chunky heeled loafers with a buckle I really love the look of these they're very feminine schoolgirl to me so I kind of reference that when styling them by wearing them with some tiny white socks. I love wearing an Oxford with white socks. And as far as the outfit goes, I went pretty feminine wearing a tiny white cropped sweater and a black silk midi skirt from Billy the Label. I love this skirt. It is so flattering and silky and soft. This is one of my favorite silhouettes wearing a high-waisted skirt with a cropped sweater. It's just very sweet and I really love how this sweater looks like. It's like white lace even though it's just like, you know, a knit. And since this outfit was pretty neutral, I added added in some flair with my brown zebra bag from The Real Real. The brand is Kate Spade. Outfit number three, I'm styling some chunky Chelsea boots because I feel like everyone has Chelsea boots and so I just had to show you my personal take on Chelsea boots, which is wearing one with a thick platform and a thick heel. I think it just makes them look a whole lot cooler. And I wore them with a very simple outfit, my favorite black Levi's that have a straight leg and a bit of a mid-rise. So they show a little bit of midriff if I'm wearing something cropped. So the shirt that I'm wearing is from Unif and it is a red cropped sweater with extra long sleeves and I really love this top because you can kind of adjust it depending on where you're going if I'm going out I probably won't button as many snaps if I'm you know going to the grocery store just wearing a top like this with these kinds of pants just always feels very 90s and so that is kind of the look I went for here and then of course the Chelsea boot just adds the height that is necessary and it's very very subtle but a good look Next up, we have quite possibly my favorite pair of shoes in this video, and that are these super shiny kind of platform combat boots, I would say. They have a really nice chunky heel and they're super lightweight. The way that I love styling this type of boot is with a long jean that has a bit of a frayed edge. I just love the look of the raw edge of the denim over some glossy boots. I just, I love it. And then I tucked in this little vintage tank that says hot and spicy. It's one of my favorite things I've thrifted. I just find it really funny and cute. And then I'm wearing my everyday bag from Rag and Bone yet again. 
we have made it to our final shoe and these ones are definitely the most funky of the bunch and I'm not sure that everyone will like them, but they are pretty much the same style as the last shoe but with yellow stitching and yellow laces and I think these are super rad. They have different colored laces online uh, and different stitching so if you're not into yellow, feel free to go for a different color, but I just love the contrast stitching, especially because I wear a lot of gold. I feel like yellow complements that pretty well, and it's fun to have a pop of color, especially with a monochromatic outfit. So that is how I styled these with a perfect little black dress. This one is from Urban Outfitters. I've had it for years. It's just the perfect 90s silhouette. And then on top of that, I'm wearing a Billy the Label blazer. It is oversized. I got it in a medium, so it's extra oversized sized and I love buttoning it up over this dress because then it basically just looks like the suit coat is your dress and it's very short and very chic. This would be so cute with some patterned tights. I have some polka dot tights that I left back home that I really love that would look killer with this outfit. And then if I was to go out and wear a bag with this outfit, I added my vintage Chanel because it honestly goes with everything and makes every outfit look just so much classier but honestly anytime i wear a blazer i just feel like so classy just instantly like i hello i'm a ceo even if i'm not so that concludes my how to style chunky shoes lookbook i hope you enjoyed it and maybe are interested in you know styling your chunky shoes a little bit different or maybe investing in a pair if you have been intimidated in the past people tell me all the time that they think they're either too short or too tall to wear platforms which i think is just crazy i think everyone deserves to wear platforms no matter your height they just make you feel powerful and I think they really look good with almost every outfit. As you can see, I had a lot of outfits, very different, and I could totally do a part two on this video because I just love a good chunky shoe, obviously. As always, thank you guys so much for watching, and if you are interested in seeing some more frequent content from me, be sure to check out my Instagram because I post on there more often than YouTube, but that's it for now. Thanks for watching, have a good one, and I will see you all very soon. Bye guys!